talked a lot about what the State Department's priorities are and, uh, and um, really talked about how we continue to coordinate things going forward. So it was a, uh, a good meeting, and I'm glad all the governors could be there. Unfortunately, Governors Aaron and Weinstein could not be here today. They had uh, business elsewhere, but the rest of the governors are here, and we have a quorum. First, uh, I am very sad uh, and also happy for him to announce the departure of Carlos Garcia Perez. Uh, he's led Radio and TV Marti at the Office of Cuba Broadcasting for the past five years. He actually tried to leave and go back to the private sector a year ago, and I, I respond to his email with, I'm ignoring this email. So it was an amazing experience because you can feel the change. And, and people are looking forward, you know, to, to, to this change and, and hopeful. Dan has been uh, a, a vital uh, and important addition to the state relationship with the board. Uh, he is a vast repository of knowledge about uh, BBG lore and, and byways, and, and we have to figure out how to use some of that institutional knowledge. I'm here today on behalf of many of my colleagues at VOA who are concerned about our journalistic credibility in connection with the intense focus on the policy initiative known as Countering Violent Extremism, or CVE. Um, just second, uh, that Dan's, I've known Dan for, I don't know, maybe seven years, and he has been absolutely terrific in, in facilitating both our and public diplomacy as well as, as BBG. And earlier this month, we unfortunately saw the one-year anniversary, which is shocking, of the arrest and imprisonment of Hadija Ismailova, investigative reporter and contributor to RFERL's Azerbaijan service. And uh, given the um, BBG a number of recommendations on reforms to our grant making in regards to internet freedom, and we decided to take that as an opportunity rather than a problem to introduce more um, transparency and accountability to the, to the program. China's cyber chief said as he prepared for the forum, China's internet censorship promotes freedom. Freedom is our goal. Order is our means. George Orwell could not have said it better. Thank you. We hope Mr. Shell and Mr. Lang Singh will reconsider their opposition to the key reform provision of the bipartisan HR 2323 bill that has been supported by all members of the House of Foreign Affairs Committee. A single CEO is not an institutional reform. CUSIB regards, urges the board to address the concerns of RFERL journalist Christina Gorlick. CUSIB supports the excellent work that has been done at Radio Free Asia and will continue to press for more funds for surrogate broadcasts and for less U.S. taxpayer resources going towards BBG bureaucracy. CUSIB remains determined to increase shortwave and medium wave radio broadcasts to China and Tibet and will oppose the reduction and elimination of these services. Uh, the strategic cooperation among the five BBG entities, and I will report more specifically and in detail in just a minute as to how that manifests itself based on a trip I recently took to Ukraine. Targeting key spheres that are aligned with U.S. foreign policy, doing more things in fewer places. increasing curation and acquisition of content and producing less original so that we can have the most impact with our original content, 
And importantly, and the fifth theme is to measure ourselves based on the impact we're having around the world uh, beyond just the reach. We will continue to be each citizen's voice every day, in every way, bolstering civil society and nurturing indigenous free press. And even as America faces some of the most difficult geopolitical and most horrific human conflicts in our lifetime, we need to ensure Radio Free Asia's strong presence in the world. Despite the regimes that work tirelessly to undermine RFA and the human dignity that we engender, RFA remains a living testimonial that America will continue to be a beacon of free expression across Asia and around the world. of governors is practically defunct in terms of its capacity to be able to tell a message around the world. So we're abdicating the ideological uh, arena, and we need to get back into If you want to be free, you have to know how free people live. If you've never known how free people live, you might not even know that you're not free. This is why programs like Radio Free Asia are so very important.